Well, here we are. This is a project I've been working on this evening. Um, we have here two identical hard drives. The hard drive here that's now been completely dismantled was given to me uh, because it completely disappeared off the machine suddenly with all its data and everything else just absolutely wouldn't work. So I tried all the obvious things first, uh, things like uh, trying it in an external USB enclosure first of all um, and then clearly it became apparent that there was something physical wrong with the drive so I went ahead and got an identical drive this one right here um, the first ditch attempt of obviously is not to expose the platters but to in fact swap over the PCB or the control board and this is it here so I used the spare parts off the new drive on the old drive and it made absolutely no difference. But interestingly enough, uh, I just thought to go ahead and exchange the platters, seeing as it was absolutely no-win scenario. This here is a hard drive with a transplanted platter in it. As you can see, head cannot index, it can't find where it is, and so the drive will continually do this without appearing on the computer. Pretty sad, but there's not much hope for this drive. And by contrast, this is the same drive with the original platter back in it. I've actually uh, taken this platter in and out of this drive a few times now so I would say it's not behaving perfectly and I wouldn't recommend lifting the lid off any hard drive unless you absolutely have to but you can see that this is working perfectly normally I'll just load an image up that's stored on the hard drive yep yeah, it's working fine it's making a few odd noises on the outer tracks there you go. Amazing. I would would have put money on this drive never working again, but